Hello friends, today I'm going to show you how I use Procreate to draw in one point perspective using the shot of Isaac from the Netflix series Heartstopper. So first I'll show you how to access the drawing guides. Click on the spanner tool in the top left corner, go to canvas and select drawing guide. This then allows you to go into Edit Drawing Guide. There are several different options here, but I want to recreate that feeling of a long corridor ending in a door, so I select Perspective and place the vanishing point where I want the corridor to lead to. This means all the horizontal lines in the corridor will lead to this one point in the distance. If you then turn Drawing Assist on, all the lines you draw will snap along the perspective lines, like this. To be able to draw freehand again, just go back into Edit Drawing Guide and turn off Assisted Drawing. Now I'll show you the time lapse of my Isaac fan art. I start with a rough sketch to get the composition I want. I then turn the drawing guide on to the settings I showed you before. You can't see the lines in the time lapse that Procreate generates, but I promise you they're there. I now sketch out the corridor and draw using assisted drawing. You can use this for all your lines if you want, but I prefer my lines to be a bit less exact, so I only use assisted drawing for the sketch, which then gets covered later. And that's how you create a drawing with one point perspective in Procreate. The other things I do that I think help enhance this are making sure that Isaac in the foreground is larger and the door in the background is smaller as it is in the distance. When I created the pattern on the carpet using a textured brush, I used the distort feature with the carpet selected and made it wider at the front and narrower in the distance. I also paid close attention to where the ceiling lights in the scene are and the shadows they created showing distance with the lighter and darker areas. Thanks for watching and I hope this video was helpful. If it was, don't forget to like this video and subscribe. If you haven't watched or read the Heartstopper series yet, I recommend you go and check them out. They're lots of fun. Thank you.